all you internet peeping time motherfuckers looking for a picture of a girl's big tits but then come across some DVD reviews and now you're watching us. How you doing? Welcome to another fantastic edition of Hillbilly D Reviews. Today we're going to be reviewing the goddamn Blu-ray of The Horseman. Now this ain't The Horseman movie with fucking Dennis Quaid doing his corny shit in it. This is a real awesome fucking Australian movie and it came over here and I seen it and I just fucking want to talk about it because it's so goddamn good. The way this thing starts off is you got this guy. I guess he's the horseman, I don't even fucking know. Anyway, this guy, he's like a mechanic, he's got this mechanic overall, he's driving through these towns, he's looking for revenge. Why is he looking for revenge? I'll tell you why. It's because his daughter, she got fucked on some video camera, she got killed, and he wants to find the motherfuckers that did it, he wants to make them pay, goddammit. He was a bug killer, he killed bugs. That's right, he's an exterminator, that's why he has the goddamn jumpsuit. Anyway. He goes in these people's house, he's like, let me spray you for some bugs, whatever. And they're like, okay, motherfucker, they're so dumb. So he comes in, next thing you know, he's slapping motherfuckers, tying them up, beating them over the head with wrenches. And he's got them all tied up and starts torturing them. He wants to find out, you know, who was behind this? How did it happen? How did my daughter get killed? How she turned into a slut sucking dick on videotape? So he goes through, he slaughters the motherfuckers, just a great classic revenge tale. But the thing is, it's not like he comes in and shoots a motherfucker, stabs a motherfucker. This motherfucker goes in with some tools, goddamn. Yeah, man. I, I, he ain't no superhero. Man. He's a he is superhero. superhero. He goes in and he'd be like, oh, you fucked her with my daughter, but And he'll, he'll, like, he'll fight a motherfucker and they will beat each other up and they'll throw each other around the kitchen and get hit over the head, yeah, whatever. He gets his ass kicked a couple times. Man. Yeah, he gets kicked up and bleed up and he's trying to hide all the scars and shit he yeah, has from yeah. all these fights. But basically, he kills his way all the way down the line. He finds, like, greasy motherfuckers living out on this ranch in the middle of Australia. You think we're hillbillies, man. We see these fuckers, right? Yeah, these motherfuckers are some outback hillbillies, yeah. man. They're taking shit to another level. We just get drunk and fucking <laughs> maybe blow up a mailbox or two. These motherfuckers break out a video camera and kill a girl and shit. Oh, That's shit. bullshit, That's man. That's awful. God damn. Yeah, that's some fucking skullduggerous bullshit right there. So he comes down, he finds that they're going to do it to another girl that he was helping. He was giving her a ride down the highway. She's a runaway pregnant junkie bitch, but she got a baby, so he's trying to protect her. She falls in the hands of these evil motherfuckers that killed his daughter, so he's got to save her now. He couldn't save his daughter, but he can save this girl, so he pushes the shit to the limit, kills a bunch of motherfuckers, and he uh, gets to the end, he finds the last motherfucker, and he wants to kill him, but shit gets fucked up, police get involved, crooked as fuck, I Damn, mean. I tell you what, man. Fuck Spoiler on that bullshit, off. but I'll leave it at that, but the ending is great, it's fine. So as a movie, because it is so fucking action-packed and shit, and you know, yeah, I'm going to give this movie, it's just a movie, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. The plot is a little thin, whatever. But you get to see a lot of ass kick, you know, and I like that. On the picture and sound, like I said, the video is crystal clear. The sound is pretty good, but kind of limited, whatever. I'm going to give that motherfucker 7.5 out of 10. Special features? Really no fucking special features, because this came out from ScreenMediaFilms.net. I don't even know who the motherfuckers are. I appreciate them bringing this shit to the U.S. shores, but they didn't put special features. Whatever, I'm cool with it, but I'm still going to give it a 0 out of 10. Got to. So, wrapping up, Horseman, it's a good fucking movie, check it out, I think you'll like it, unless you're just an asshole and doesn't like anything, but, you know, if you're just a normal motherfucker, you should like this a lot. So this is The Goat, signing off, and I gotta say, hey, if you got a problem with a bleeding asshole, don't take your girlfriend's maxi pad and stick it up your ass, that's just fucking wrong, alright? Be a man, just stick a water toilet paper up there, don't run the maxi pad route. See you guys on the other side. Boom!